Okay, here's a tutorial on how to create a keyboard shortcut key for the sound control. So this is the keyboard shortcut, the icon that will be created and that will allow us to use the keyboard. For example, Ctrl, Alt, Shift and S will be pressed and the volume control will pop up here in the lower right corner. So let's try that. Ctrl, Alt, Shift and S and there's the volume, con volume control. Okay, and then you can use the scroll wheel of your mouse up and down to control the sound volume, up and down. Okay, once again, Control Alt, Shift and S, and that small thing appears, then use the scroll wheel of your mouse to control the sound. Okay, let's see how to do that. So we are going to make this small file again. Right click on your desktop, go to new and shortcut, new shortcut. Okay, here type in SND, SNDVOL, that's from sound volume, leave an empty space, dash F, and nine times the number one. That's for positioning. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. That's for positioning that volume control a little window here in the lower right corner. Okay, click next. I'll give a name if you want. It's this name for the file. And click finish. Okay, here's the file that we just created. Right click on it and go to properties. Okay, and here on the properties window, click inside here to shortcut key, here, it's currently set to none, and press some keys on the keyboard, for example, Ctrl, Alt, Shift, and it was S for the previous shortcut, now I'm going to use W. So after pressing Ctrl, Alt, Ctrl, Alt, Shift, and W, the shortcut remains there, okay, and we can close this window, press OK. Make sure that shortcut that you selected won't interfere with another software's shortcut. Okay, and by using this icon, we already have that shortcut, Ctrl, Alt, Shift, and W, and voila, it's working. Now just scroll up and down, and you can control the sound volume of your computer. That's it. Thanks for watching, and... Bye-bye.